Hi, I'm Leroy Scott, your relationship coach, and thank you so much for tuning in to Leroy Scott TV again. I am still talking about marriage. I'm still talking about relationships. I'm not going to stop talking about it because it's so important. It's what I do, and I believe that everybody has the opportunity to live an effective life in a corporate relationship with the person they love that God sent to you, and I want the best for you. So what I'm going to talk about today is two things that we all are very familiar with. I'm just going to reiterate them because I know you've heard them before, but maybe I'll talk about them in a way that you've never heard. They are strengths and weaknesses. Now, when you think about strengths and weaknesses, we want to think about it in the context of relationship, not just your individual strengths, um, and your individual weaknesses, but also your corporate strengths and your corporate weaknesses. So what am I saying? This is what I'm saying. You and your partner are both going to have strengths and you're both going to have weaknesses. And what I want you to do is be able to identify your individual, individual strengths, what you're really, really good at, and then your individual weaknesses, what you're not so good at. Now, obviously, individual strengths are more easily to identify and claim than weaknesses are. However, Weaknesses have a tendency, when they are identified, they have a tendency to give you the most growth and the most maturity if you're able to accept them. Now, your individual strengths and your individual weaknesses, those things are going to come together between you and your partner in a covenant relationship. It means that you're going to bring some things to the table that are very good and things that are very bad. And your partner is going to bring things to the table that are very good and that are very bad. What's going to happen when you get together? Well, What's going to happen when you come together is that your individual strengths and weaknesses are going to be tied together. And what you're going to develop systemically are corporate strengths and corporate weaknesses. Now, you've got to know what those things are. So this is what you do. I want you to get a card, get a piece of paper, and I want you to write down your individual strengths on one side of the paper. I want you to flip the paper over, and I want you to write down your individual weaknesses. I want you and your partner to do the same thing with separate sheets of paper. Then I want you to come together and I want you to talk about your individual strengths and your individual weaknesses. I want you to get a separate sheet of paper and I want you to take from those strengths. When those strengths come together, I want you to identify what are your corporate strengths, meaning that two individual strengths that come together and when they come together, they form corporate strengths. Cor your corporate strength is what you're going to need to have your marriage survive. And if you know how they work together and what they are, then you're going to have much more success in trying to fulfill the mission that God has put you on as a married couple, right? Your weaknesses. When you get into arguments, when you get into conflict, if you know what your corporate weaknesses are, you're going to have more insight in your ability to resolve those things. So grab your paper, grab your pens, have a lot of fun, enjoy that. We'll see you next time at Leroy Scott TV, www.leroyscott.com. Don't forget, visit my website and get the book, Creating Possibilities in Marriage. God bless you.